let's talk about these two workshops. You're doing a program on lucid dreaming in the Toltec tradition. Tell us a little something about this. It's not exactly lucid dreaming because lucidity is uh, to be aware that you're dreaming when you're dreaming and that. It will be taught a mainly practice because the practice is the one that gives the results, the knowledge. If, if you don't practice, it will be like something you know and, and that's all. So I will be teaching the importance of dreaming and then one sacred technique of how to sow or to plant your life through your dreams. To, because when we are falling asleep, we cross through a state that is called hypnagogic. Now by science, the ancient Mexicans just knew that, that in that state, you should do a certain type of readings, for example, if you're going to do it for a physical issue. To destroy the issue, then the dreams that created that, then the energy that was creating that, then like kind of your reflection that is a metaphor of the identification between our reflection and our reality, and then how to plant the dream with intention that you are going to dream certain archetype. For example, for physical healing, it could be the serpent. For emotional healing, it could be or the hummingbird of Jijawa, uh, like that. There are many others. Uh, and to begin telling to your... Uh, Nowadays, call, uh, we name it unconscious, but in the ancient times, you're now well to dream that. That actually, to be able to plant it won't make that you dream it the same night, but it will be eventually changing the way you dream. And if you change the way you dream, it, it, it will change the, the way you live. And then I will t- t- teach them, the people like a little a dream interpretation, how to do dream recall, and then how to cancel dreams that will create, because according to the ancient Mexicans, you created everything from your dreams. It was first the dream and then the experience. How to cancel the dreams that will create problems uh, of any issue, and how to get like lucidity in the moment that or the serpent appears, or jawar, and that you recognize that healing. And that entire afternoon, can change uh, the way you live. And also how yes. to wake up. Because we, uh, when we're waking up, now it's so sad that uh, only the alarm rings and everyone goes directly to, to the shower or whatever. And really, we are crossing through other like hypno, uh, hypnotic state called, uh, that nowadays science calls hypnobompic. And if we could, can, uh, we could stay those famous five minutes more of, of sleep creating images of archetypes because dream, uh, dreams talk like in a, in a symbolic way. Uh, we can make huge differences in our life only by those five minutes. So we'll be teaching all of that.